Making my first venture to the valley since they were relegated from the championship. So it's been a little while. Uh, I've had no luck with the trains today. I was meant to get here just after two. And now I'll kick off in 15 minutes. So I miss my connection in Raynham. And the train that you have to get is so bloody slow. But on the way now. And here's the Ipswich band. Because they are. They are going very well this season, they're second at the minute. So as I was saying, Ipswich going really well, second in the league at the minute. Up there with Plymouth Argyle. While Charlton are back in eighth. So playoffs still very much a possibility, but um, I think the Ipswich fans are a good voice and very confident that they can bring they can head back to Norfolk with the points. I'm not so sure. The game at the Valley is never easy, although MK Dons just won here on Tuesday, so I'm not really sure what to make of the team at the minute. I guess we'll see. And I'm just speeding off to get my seat now. It's actually a bit busier than I thought it was going to be. The uh, website, it didn't look overly like a lot of tickets have been sold, but there's a lot of people walking with me at the moment. So I guess we'll see. Oh. Managed to get my seat with about five minutes to kick off. It's a pretty good atmosphere.
I think the Charlton manager might be in a bit of trouble here. I don't know, he's gone to the Ipswich. One of the Ipswich group. Someone's brought in a really loud whistle and it's confused the players on a number of occasions. Tidy player from called John Jules, who I believe's dad played the cat in Red Dwarf. Could be wrong on that, but I'm pretty sure that's the case. Is really tidy and nice to see. Um, so he's one to watch in the second half. Look for a bit more from Charlton. There's nothing really in attack. A bit of a shame. Given some of the, the forwards I've seen play before. So yeah, hoping for more in the second half from the addicts. That's all I'll say on that, really. It's been a good back to
Chance for 4 4. Who knows? No. I don't think it's going to happen, unfortunately. I'm keep the ball. I'll tell you what.
stuff it really is it's going to be a long trip back to Dorset now not Dorset Norfolk unbelievable Charlton 4 Ipswich 4 Heading out the valley now. The real irony was that Charlton played so much better once their coach got sent off. They were thoroughly outplayed, two nil, just gone two nil down. Ended up coming from the death twice. Ridiculous scenes at the valley. What a game! I don't know what else to say other than what a game. Absolute madness. Say what a great advert for not leaving early. So many Charlton fans left when the, the fourth Ipswich goal went in and uh, ended up missing a 97th and a 99th minute goal, which uh, ultimately got their team a point. So, yeah, it's just uh, the age old thing don't leave the game early. You never know what might happen. Your team might have just gone 2 0 down, but you may yet get one more moment of euphoria. It's just absolute madness of the valley today. Absolutely insane. I can't really sum up to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> 